Christmas, Eliza, Carmela, Papa, um, m my mom, and my aunts, uh, Aunt Andrea, uh, oh, Eliza, I hope you're doing really well in Mexico, even though you can't come for Christmas, I wanted to say Merry Christmas to you. went camping in a forest called Crystal Lake. When he got there, he set up camp. Max loves to hike and camp, and he always bird watches when he goes. When he sat down on his chair, he heard a rustle in the bushes. When Max went to go see what it was, he found a big black bear with shiny blue eyes and big silver claws. The bear was rubbing his back on a tree. The bear looked at Max, twitched his eye, and then t turned back at the tree. Max thought the bear looked harmless, so he found a dead squirrel and put it on a fishing pole because he wanted to take. T oh, he wanted to lure the bear home. He went back to the bear. Bear hid hid in the bush and cast the fishing pole over to the bear. The bear followed him all the way to the cage he had in his, had in his truck. When the, bear, when the bear was in the cage, Max rushed over to the door and shut it closed. The whole way there, the bear was calm and chill. The, when he got there, he led the bear in through the back door, but when the bear came inside, he sat on the couch and broke it in half. Max went to go get fo food for the bear, a bear to eat. A big paw swiped through the counter, and it smashed into tiny bits. Max finally realized what he did was a very bad idea. Max drove the bear back to the to the forest. Max went back home and had to pay the damages to his house, which was two million seventy five do five seventy five thousand dollars. Max re then realized it would be better uh, better to buy a Medi Teddy for companionship. Max named his Medi Teddy Jacob. The end. 